Hi guys and welcome back to Guide Nation. In today's video, I will show you how to create a Gumroad store. So creating a Gumroad store is pretty easy and can be done in just 5 steps. The first step is signing up for an account. In order to do that, head over to any browser on your PC. Now go to https gumroad.com. After coming to Gumroad's website, you'll have to simply click on start selling. Now on this page, you'll have to sign up and in order to do that, simply enter your email and create a password. You can also use Facebook, Google, X or Stripe for creating an account. But I'm going to use email. So enter your email and password and click on create an account. After you click on create account, you will have a new Gumroad account created on the next step. On this page, you will see your dashboard appearing at the left corner. So coming down to the second step, we'll have to craft our seller profile. So fill out your profile details including a username, short bio, and an avatar image. Your username will be a part of your store's URL. So choose something memorable. So what we are going to do is simply scroll down on this page under getting started section, we'll have to click on customize your profile. Now add a username, your name, a short bio, and a logo. So in order to add a logo, we'll have to simply click on the cross icon at the top right corner and click on upload. Now choose a logo for your profile. So for example, I'm going to choose this logo. You can also connect to X by clicking on the connect to X button, but we are going to leave it for now. Now after filling out your information, click on update settings. So it's giving us, you have to confirm your email address before you can update your settings notification. So you'll have to basically open your Gmail account using which you have created your account and search for Gumroad's email. Click on confirm email. Our account has been successfully confirmed. Now we'll go back to the settings and click on update settings. After we click on update settings, you can see the changes have been saved. Now we'll go to home, scroll down. We'll head over to our third step that is adding our product. So Gumroad lets you sell various digital products like eBooks, software licenses, audio files, and even video content. When adding a product, you will have to provide a title, description, and set the price. You can also add rich media like images and videos to showcase your product. And in order to do that, we'll have to simply click on create your first product under getting started. After you click on create your first product, you'll be navigated to your products section on your dashboard. And now you'll have to choose whether your product is a digital product, course or a tutorial, ebook, membership, physical good or a bundle. So I'm going to choose ebook. You can choose anything according to your preference and now add a price to your product. So my product will be $5. So I'll select $5. You can also choose another currency by clicking on the dollar icon. After that, click on next customize. Now on this page, you'll have to name your product. So I'm naming it perspectivize. Now you have to add a description, your URL. After adding a URL, scroll down and navigate to the cover section. Here, click on upload images or video. Now you can add an external link or you can also add computer files. So click on computer files, choose your product's image and click on open. So this is my product image. Now under thumbnail section, you'll have to upload an image that will appear in the Gumroad library, discover and profile pages. Your image should be a square and at least 600 into 600 pixels. And it should be in JPG, PNG or GIF format. So click on upload files, click on computer files, choose an image and click on open. So as you can see, you'll have to upload an image that must be a square. So we'll go to our image, crop it into a square, click on edit image. Now come back to upload files, select computer files, select the image. Now it's saying at our image should be at least 600 into 600 pixels. In order to do that, we'll head over to imresizer.com and click on upload images. Now go to downloads, choose an square image of your product, click on open. Make sure both the width and height is set at 600. After ensuring this, click on next download. Picture just got downloaded on my PC. So we'll head back to Gumroad. Click on upload files, click on computer files, go to downloads and choose the image that we just downloaded. So as you can see, I'm able to upload a thumbnail for my product. It looks pretty good. Now under product info, we'll have to add a call to action. So our call to action will be buy this. So under summary, you will have to add what the buyer will get after buying this product. So I'll add, you'll get life enriching knowledge. Now under additional details, you can add any value that you want. For example, this is pages. So I'll add, there are hundred pages in this book. You can add more details by clicking on 
plus add detail. After that, scroll down and you will be able to add pricing. And you can also offer variations of this product by clicking on add version. If you want to do that, click on add version and you can do it according to your preference, but I'm going to leave it. So you can do all these settings according to your preference and click on save and continue. After that, you can add content for your product. I'm going to click on publish and continue. Now, as you can see, I just uploaded my product on Gumroad. So I'll click on save changes and go to home, come back to products. As you can see, this is the product that I just uploaded on Gumroad. So this was all about creating a Gumroad store and adding a product. But your Gumroad store will also need a payment method. So step four is setting up the payment. Gumroad integrates with popular payment processes like Stripe and PayPal. Choose your preferred payment method and configure your payout information. And in order to do that, we'll have to click on payouts option at the bottom of our dashboard and click on settings at the top right corner. Choose your country and to ensure prompt payouts, please check off each item. You have a valid government issued photo ID. You have a proof of residence within the country. And if you are signing up as a business, it should be registered in the country above that you're choosing just right here. So you have to forfeit your balance if you want to change your country in the future. After ensuring all these things, click on save. Now choose your payment method, whether you want PayPal or Stripe. So I'm going to choose PayPal. Now you'll have to add PayPal email, your account type, whether it is individual or business. So my account type is individual. Add your name, address, city, postal code, country, and phone number. You'll have to also add your day of birth. After filling out the information on this page, click on update settings. Now you're all set for your payment. And with that, we'll head over to our last step that is promoting your store. And with your store setup, it's time to spend the word. Promote your Gumroad store on social media platforms, your website, or even through email marketing to reach your potential customers by promoting your store. So this is the product that we just created on our Gumroad store. If we click on this link, we'll be headed over to our product page. As you can see, this is my product. Anyone can buy this, choose a quantity and click on buy this to get my product from Gumroad store. So that's how you create an attractive Gumroad store. If you found this video helpful, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe and hit that notification bell. And I'll see you in the next video.